Michigan now has more than 1,300 confirmed cases of coronavirus. They include the first known cases in Nuego and Muskegon counties. No details available yet about the Nuego County patient, but Muskegon announced its first case this morning, then announced a second case just about an hour ago. 13 on your side, Lakeshore reporter John Mills tells us what leaders in Muskegon County are now asking people to do. The Muskegon County resident was tested March 20th. The Muskegon County Health Department received confirmation of the positive test result Sunday evening. Muskegon County Health Officer Kathy Moore can only release limited information about Muskegon County's first COVID-19 patient. The adult female has no history of domestic or international travel. She's in isolation at home and public health investigators have already made contact with individuals the woman was in contact with during the last two weeks. They can self-isolate and then um, report to us any symptoms or if they start exhibiting symptoms. 10 negative Muskegon County tests have been returned. Results from others are pending. We now have approximately 45 additional tests pending. And Moore says there's a critical shortage of tests to administer. And so we can't test everyone. If you feel ill, please stay at home, call your primary care physician. If you do not have a primary care physician, if you go on the Mercy Health website, which is mercyhealth.com, and you click on the learn more button, it will actually take you to a place that shows you a 1-800 number that you can call, and we'll be happy to give advice to any of the residents of Muskegon County. The region's 211 helpline is ready to help community members with questions about food, transportation, and other community services. Muskegon County Prosecutor DJ Hilson says residents who do not follow the governor's executive orders could face misdemeanor charges. I'm asking you, please, for your own health and your own safety, these guidelines are there for a reason. Let's not violate them. And Muskegon's mayor is challenging the community to show its best during the pandemic. Let's be good neighbors, good parents, good students. Let's practice patience and kindness. Local police also want to warn you about scammers looking to trick you into giving them your credit card or social security number over the phone. Police also want you to remove valuables from your cars. Also keep doors to cars and homes locked. In Muskegon County, John Mills, 13 on your side.